All right, but uh, you go ahead. You're wired, so you play first. Yeah. Uh, uh, that. Hey. Hey, your turn. That's a strange start. All right. Well, potato there. <laughs> hey guys, Jerry here. Welcome back to Greg Take, where Buddha has made us a fantastic little chessboard here. We haven't quite, you know, gotten all the proper pieces sorted out, but uh, we're just testing it out for a moment here. Says you, these pieces are fantastic. But they're all right, I guess. Check. Me. <laughs> <laughs> Chicken. All right, should we should we do some, yeah, some proper stuff? Let's leave this for later. We'll continue. Uh, <laughs> um, how do we? Oh yeah. Uh, my turn. Okay. <laughs> All right. So first things first. Our little basement has received an upgrade since last time. Basically, well. the doors really glitch you. Um, and <laughs> other than that, we've decided that we were tired of waiting for the um, the car to slowly empty out all the zipper coke ovens so we could actually move the uh, fluid loaders um, without losing, you know, 96 buckets worth of crystals. So we made this big tank to store it all. It's and that holds 720 buckets. It's actually full. Like it's this, th this card load here will fill it up. Oh, Jesus. So we have a good old-fashioned uh, Grecte pipe here with a pump cover on it, pumping stuff okay. into the steam boiler, so that's running constantly. Big 2x2x2 uh, two by two by two low-pressure boiler tank. 2x2x2. Two by two by two. <laughs> it is 2x2x2. Two by two by two. The tank went marching 2x2x2, two by, two by, two by hurrah, hurrah. What? And if we look over on the other side here, along the little ugly tunnel here, we need to shine up a bit. Um, we've made or we've extended the track so that the loaders are no longer here, but over here. So all twelve of these are now hooked up. Oh shit! To the delivery system. Did you? Uh, it'll, it'll return. Oh, why did you? Oh well. I turned it off to slow it down, and then I turned it back on to you know. Yeah. Not slow it down. Un unslow it. Yeah, it's uh, a little cleaner up here. It does um, clean up a bit. But um, the the other thing we still haven't done yet is we need a system to move charcoal here to the other boiler. And potentially convert it into elementum. Combine, I like the second one better. Combine, we, we would need to combine that with a um, cobblestone generator though. Or potentially... That's easy enough. Like basically, we'd need a, a source of um, entropy. The um, the aspect there, the essence. Which is cobblestone. Yep. Cobblestone has it. Um, tiny piles of ashes has it as well. But I don't think we're producing enough tiny piles of ashes, honestly. Probably not. So that's gonna have to. Um, basically, it's on the drawing board, and we're working on it. But uh, we're not quite there yet. Where we are, though, is we have a fully automatic. Um, Last furnace, as you know, we have our um, electrolyzer here, which now has received a little void pipe, so we can actually delete the fluids coming out of it if we don't want to keep them. Right. Because quite a lot of the fluids from Greg Tech 5 have no purpose. Like oxygen? Wait, it has a purpose. Oxygen has plenty of purpose, but um, stuff like um, chlorine here has very little. Huh. So there's no reason that we know keep tank end on end of tanks. We have this void pipe instead, so we can just, you know, void it. So we got that going for us, and finally we have our little setup out here with the Applied Logistics 2 Energy Acceptor and the Charger, which allows us to charge those quartz. And we've put a proper Fix roof this. on it, so that we won't have any issues at all with rain on these machines. We, we fixed it. So, today, we need to get started on actually making a computer. Yay. Because computers just make... Crafting and such, so, so much easier. Crafting and storage. I'm just gonna get all these and scrap the presses. I realized I forgot those. Downstairs. Aha. Yes. Aha. Alright, Buddha. So, hey. you've played Applied Logistics 2 before, uh, for yes. 1.7. 1 
So you know that the next thing we, meet, we need is my favorite machine of all times. Right? Yes, that one. I'm gonna walk away slowly now because I can't remember the name of the things. The inscriber. Yeah, that thing. Yes, exactly. So, Which I actually is what I was thinking of, so I'm, on, I'm good here. Yeah, well, I need to, first of all, I need to make two sticky pistons. Uh, well, you need a piston, then you need some time alone. Ah. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> Yuck. You're so funny. So, so, so funny. Said you need two? There. That's a slime. Ding. Ding what? Oh, the clock went off. Oh. Oh, yeah, I actually heard it this time. Um, it's very quiet, though. I think I have blocks turned down so far because of the, um, you know, the, the annoying great tech machines, yeah. Alright, so I got the two sticker pistons. Now I need a bunch of iron and I need a flux crystal. So, oh, I got a whole bunch of stuff in here. Yep, I do have a bunch of stuff. Um, so, inscriber. We can put that there. And it should be powered. Now, basically, the way that this works is that you put, um, you take your silicon plates or whatever, and then you take, um, I think this one, and then you put that in and that in, and then it does something with it. Oh, it and doesn't then, require any power. Oh, it does. And then you get this silicon thing, and then you can take this silicon along with like some, some gold and some redstone, and then you take the gold and the redstone hold on that's that's you know, like the these presses here let's see the calculation uses what that's so the squats engineering is that one and logic is gold okay so you take the logic press and you take some gold and then that does some stuff as well and then when you finally have all these components which you just stole did not I just throw a very expensive component on the floor, that's all. <laughs> there you go. Put those three together. And you can make a very basic logic processor. Which you can then use to make all the different computer p components. <sighs> this is a rather long process, to be frank. And there is something blocking us from really getting started on it. And that is um, that we need, or a, a, we could very well use to have... Um, some pu pure flux crystals and pure quartz crystals, like we're gonna need those things. How do we get the pure stuff? We need to make a seed and then we need to grow the seed. Now the annoying thing about that is that um, these seeds are very, very slow to grow. Um, allow me to demonstrate in just a moment, I just need to make some. Flux seed, flux dust and sand, okay. Yeah. So if you take so the, if flux. you take take those two, two flux crystals and toss in the macerator. Yeah, I'll, I'll get to work on that. Hello, masturbator. The masturbator. Well, that's actually not what I said, but I thought about that after I said it, and I was like, wait that, a minute. That is what you said. I said macerator. Uh, mas masturbator. I did. I didn't put the T in though. I said masturbator. <laughs> the damage is done. It is done. Alright, so I need to make a quartz fiber. So I need sort of quartz Sand. dust and glass. Surely we should have some sort of quartz dust somewhere. Right? Alright, so where do I plant these four seeds? Um, you, the toss them in, you toss them in one of the little water ponds uh, up on the balcony. Oh, okay. Alright, so we don't have sort of quartz dust ready. I guess we shall macerate up some sort of quartz ore then. Now, do I have to pick these up halfway through or no, no, something? No, 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 they, they, they want these spawn. Oh, I'm thinking of uh, pneumatic craft. Can you throw more than one in? Yeah, yeah, you can just toss them all in one pond if you want. Yeah, I want to be creative with it. What's the point in having two ponds if you only use one? Alright, let's see here. Quartz. That's the quartz. Now I need this, of course, crushed up again, or hammered up. 
I think that's by far the fastest way to do it. Ah, lovely silent hammer. <laughs> What's go. that? What'd you say? Oh, nothing, because there's a muffler? Hooray! And... 3, 2, 1, clean. Clean so there's quartz dust. Yay. Hey. Now I can take this, combine with the glass, and I get these quartz fibers. Now the quartz fibers, if I then combine them with some more flux crystals, which I need to make more of, because I keep using them all so quickly... Good thing we have a charger, uh, because we're gonna run out of charger to squat at this rate. Huzzah. There we are, ME glass cable fluix. Great. Now, I can make, hopefully, the, uh, the thing I wanted to make. Um, basically, Buddha, try picking up your seats now and see how far they've come along. Oh, I'm not, uh, okay. You're up there, why are you... F uh. Because... You are sort of uh, the... Uh, the seed dude? No, no, but but you you planted them, so you should check up on them. Uh, 0.0%. 0 0.0%, 0 and that's in, you know, in what, four minutes? That's, really, that's a really, really slow process. Can we agree on that? Yes. Now what I want to do is I want to put this thing there, and then put these two remaining cables. Uh, dang it, I flipped this the wrong way around. I do I really need to get power from the top of this? Apparently. Yeah, I do. Um, at least that. Don't think Are I you one cable short? I'm two cable short actually, but I, so I need to just quickly do this again. And there. And then I can... there. There we go. Now you can see this thing starts glowing. And it's just device online when you wait over it. Um, so now let's just, you know, wait a couple of seconds. Try picking up your seats right now, actually. How are they doing? 1%. So in 10 seconds, they've gone a percent, whereas in, you know, in 5 minutes before, they didn't. See in 2 minutes. <laughs> so yeah. Basically what that uh, amounts to. That That's a crystal growth accelerator. I and can see very, why they very, called it such a fancy name. It's a very, very fancy thing. Very All straight right, so, to the point name, though, so I agree with it. Yeah, 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 it's pretty good. So that's the basis of, you know, like, we have the ability to make the parts now. Now we just need to actually make the parts of the computer. Uh, so we got an energy acceptor, we have the inscriber, we have the charger, and we have the crystal growth accelerator. So, the most basic computer is basically a storage system, which, for the really, really basic one, would just be an ME test. Yeah. But I think we want to skip that step and basically go one ahead. So, what I want to make is an ME drive. Now, that's going to need two engineering processes and some more cables. So, engineering processes, which means that I need to make some more silicon things here in the stupid inscriber. That was rude. Like this thing is like this thing's just so bothersome to automate. But it's really, really bothersome if you don't automate it as well, so um diamonds, four diamonds. I need two of them right now. Alright, engineering and diamond. Diamonds Da 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 diamonds, da 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 diamonds. Redstone. Oh. But at least I think the shift clicking stuff works now, although I don't want to use my backpack as a component. But yeah, your seats, uh, did you put all the four seats in one spot? Yeah, well, you put a crystal growth accelerator there, so. Yeah. <laughs> it made sense. It really, really did. It did make sense, didn't it? Yes. I wonder what these upgrades are for. 
Anyway, engineering processor. That means I can... Hopefully now, if I have enough cables left, I can make the ME drive. Yes. Alright, but we have an ME drive. Praise. ME drive. A U drive? I'm just going to put it out here on the balcony like everything else, because, you know, balcony. Balcony computers are the best. It gives you a wonderful view while you waste away. Exactly. So, in order for us to um, get much out of this, we need a... Um, we need some storage devices as well. Uh, 4K or 1K? Uh, I, was just, I was just thinking some, some 1K ones in the first place, you know. So that's a 1K storage component. Now I need to make it into a hard drive. Four types of crystal, which we got some really cheap crystal we can use for that. And then logic processor and four redstone. I don't know about the, the really cheap crystal. Uh, the, uh, the, uh, Certus Quartz, you can use for it. Yeah, but uh, the thing is, we don't actually have a lot of that. There we are. We got more of it than the rest. Alright, so, I just got an achievement better than chests. I made a 1k ME storage cell. So now we have a storage unit with um, space in it, but we have no way to access it. So, you know... Baby steps. We're getting there one at a, one step at a time. Yeah. So now we need to be able to access so we can have an interface so we can actually put stuff in and take stuff out. And for that, we need a... Uh, why do I have to look at all these bloody cable facades? I don't know. I don't know either. Um, hold on, hold on, hold on. Where are the access panels, actually? The terminals. There they are. All right. So we need a. I need to make an illuminated panel, which means I need more quartz glass. So more quartz dust. I really haven't made enough quartz dust. This is an issue, Buddha. Uh oh. Bum bum bum. I should have made hell of a lot more of this stuff. Um. All right, so I need some glowstone. Do I have glowstone? I do have glowstone. Which means I can now hopefully make an illuminated panel. Yep. All right. So now we need a formation core and an annihilation core. I guess very confusing, doesn't it? Inhalation core? Inhalation core, yeah, exactly. You're damn right, Buddha. Yeah, yeah. You got to work on this quick. Yeah, well, I'm, you know, trying to be efficient here. So your seats are now at forty-five percent. Praise. <sighs> so they're slowly getting there. Um, you know, making all these circuit boards like that is by far the most annoying bit of making computers. Now, is there a way to make this go faster? There is not a way to make it go faster, but there is a way to automate it if you have, like, free harbors. Or a shit ton of pipes. Acceleration card. Or potentially that. Um, I bet... You get two per recipe, too. I'll bet you five uh, gold bars that I need um, more fluid crystals, so... You'll need quickly. two for the acceleration cards. Yeah, but right now I'm more worried about the... Oh, I need flux dust. Alright, time to macerate these up, then. There's gonna be a lot of running back and forth here, isn't there? Yes. But yeah, um, this chest up here is starting to be, become really confusing, you know, with all the uh, cross doors. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and agree with hammer me? up some of this salt ore. I need nether quartz. And those quartz. Alright. Formation core. There. Annihilation core. There. And I need one more logic processor, which means I'll need to make even more of these silicon things. 
these silly things. Are you tossing silver squash dust at me? Well, uh, yeah. Thank you. You even cleaned sure. it up for me. Yes, I did. Aren't I wonderful? <laughs> We're getting there, Buddha. We're getting there. Praise. Could you bring me a crafting table? Bring forth a crafting table! There's one right up there. Yeah, but I need one more. I need one to sacrifice as a component. Ignore the chest full of planks up here. Oh, I ignored the two stacks of planks on me. I'm, I'm good at ignoring things. Here's your crafting table, then. <laughs> and I also just realized that I need a pure Surtis Quartz crystal before I can actually make the... Uh, So I need to make a sort of quartz seed, which means I need some sand. Phew, phew. And then we also need to wait for this thing to grow. Things that probably shouldn't work? Putting salt in water and it getting clean. <laughs> oh, it actually does work. It's just that you you know have to you have to make sure that the water you use is actually saturated with salt. So it's it's brine and not just salt. Or, um, or not yeah. just water. All right. So basically, Buddha. Um, Ow. We're gonna have yes. need to pause a bit because I need to wait for these uh, crystals to actually grow now. I needed the pure status quartz crystal, which I only just got the seed in going for. Oh well. So enjoy this picture of a pig while you wait. All right. Status quartz pure quartz crystals are finally done. So we can now just toss one of those in here and get started making the calculation processor. So that, that, and that. And then once this one is done, we can finally continue, hopefully, um, I think I might need one of these as well. Finally continue making the terminal that we want. So I think for an yeah, I need one of these, and then I need to upgrade this into the crafting terminal. There we are. Now look at that, Buddha. We now have a fully functioning computer. We can put stuff in here. We can craft from it. And it's wonderful. Yeah, it's very it's basic. Chest without the chest. It's very basic, but it's, fu it's functional. And we have very limited space in here, but... It's a start. Yay! We got like it's, it. It's, it's basically all the components for a fully functioning computer. Now, there are of course additions we can make to these, but uh, we'll surely get to those later on, like uh, oh, automatic yeah. crafting and such. But for now at least, I believe that um, we shall say bye, and then at some point in the future we shall make a lot more crystal growth accelerators so we don't have to wait for crystals to grow anymore. So, until next time, bye! Bye!